Union ministers Prakash Javadekar, Nitin Gadkari and Narendra Singh Tomar communicated the key decisions at the cabinet meet today. Javadekar said that several steps were taken by the government to boost MSMEs. Rupees 20,000 crores will be infused into the sector and the definition of MSMEs has also been widened. Several decisions have also been taken for the welfare of farmers. The MSPs for Kharif crops have been increased and farmers will also get more time to repay their loans now until August. The Directorate General of Civil Aviation on Monday asked airlines to allot seats and flights in a manner that the middle seats are left vacant to the extent possible. In case a flyer has to be allotted the middle seat due to a high passenger load, then additional protective equipment like wrap-around gowns of the Ministry of Textile approved standards have to be provided. Over 1,000 imported products will not be available at paramilitary canteens across the country from today in a Swadeshi push after the Prime Minister's announcement of an Atma Nirbhar Bharat. The delisting of the imported products comes after the government last month announced that paramilitary canteens will only sell indigenous or Indian products from June the 1st in a bid to give a fillip to domestic industries. China said that the overall situation at the border with India was stable and controllable and both the countries have unimpeded communication channels to resolve the issues through dialogue and consultations. The Indian Army too has been saying that India and China military commanders have been in talks to address differences over the boundary in eastern Ladakh, where tensions have been running high between the two sides. Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal announced that the capital's borders will be sealed for the next one week. Essential services are exempted. A decision will be taken on the lifting in one week after suggestions from citizens. Starting today, all barber shops and salons will be opened, but spas will remain closed. All shops can also open with no odd even restrictions and rickshaws and auto rickshaws can ply with no bar on the number of passengers. Prime Minister Narendra Modi hailed the contribution of medical workers during the coronavirus pandemic. Addressing an event at the Rajiv Gandhi Health University in Bengaluru via video conferencing, Modi said at the root of India's brave fight against COVID-19 is the hard work of the medical community and our corona warriors. He also stressed that violence against COVID warriors will not be tolerated. The southwest monsoon hit Kerala today morning, making it a timely onset over the southern state for the first time since 2013. The country receives over 70% of its annual rainfall from this season between June and September. Wajid Khan of Bollywood music composer duo Sajid Wajid passed away in Mumbai on Sunday due to complications arising from a renal ailment and COVID-19. He was 42 years old. He is credited with albums like Dabang and Wanted. Many celebrities from the Hindi film industry took to Twitter to express their grief.